Jurgen Klopp makes transfer mistake as Liverpool handed welcome Virgil van Dijk boost. Your Liverpool Morning Digest, including a piece from Theo Squires on Klopp's transfer mistake, plus there's a Van Dyke and Gomez boost. Here is your Liverpool Morning Digest for Wednesday, May 5th. Jurgen Klopp's transfer mistake. It has admittedly been a season to forget for Liverpool's class of 2020 Premier League title winners, writes Theo Squires. Down in 7th in the table, the Reds are 7 points off the top 4 and in real risk of missing out next season's Champions League. However, it is a rather different story for one member of Jurgen Klopp's title-winning squad. Having been limited to just 10 Premier League appearances last year, Dejan Lovren has certainly made up for lost time since joining Zenit St. Petersburg back in July. The Croatian made it back-to-back -back title wins on Sunday after Zenit thrashed Lokomotiv Moscow 6-1 to clinch the Russian Premier League. And while the 31-year-old missed the game through a muscle injury, his contributions for his new side cannot be questioned. Signing a three-year deal after joining the Russian outfit in a £11 million deal in July, Lovren helped Zenit win the Super Cup on his debut for the club and has not looked back since. Named club captain back in November after skipper Artem Dezuba was stripped of the armband after an explicit video of him went viral. He has made 28 appearances to date since signing for Zenit and wasted no time in leading his side to title glory and a place in next year's Champions League group stages. It is a stark contrast to his former teammates' fortunes at Anfield following a trophyless year. and Lovren's own return during his last two seasons on Merseyside as injury ultimately saw him drop down the pecking order. Virgil van Dijk and Joe Gomez boost Liverpool stars Virgil van Dijk and Joe Gomez both look to be stepping up their return to full fitness. The centre-back duo have been out of action for several months with long-term knee injuries, and remain pretty much certain not to play a part this season. Van Dyke suffered an ACL injury in the Merseyside Derby at Goodison Park in October, and has gradually been posting updates on the progress of his return. For Gomez, he has been out since he also suffered an ACL injury while on international duty with England in November. The pair have been patiently building up their return to full fitness. And now the latest photos from the AXA training center will provide a welcome boost for everyone connected with Liverpool.
Pictured in training, both Van Dyke and Gomez appear to be taking part in light sessions on their own away from the rest of the group.